Hi, in this video what we are going to do is we're going to find the weighted mean with the um, TI-84 graphing calculator. Um, if you wanted to do hand calculations with this, I have shown another video, or I do have another video that addresses that. Um, in order to do hand calculations, recall that you would take um, your average value for that category um, times the weight of the category, and you would create another column, and then you would sum that and then divide it by the sum of the weights. Um, in this case, because of the fact that our weights do add up to 100% or 1, um, we are dividing by 1. It does not matter how you put it into your calculator. You can either put this in as 0 0.5, 0 0.15, 0 0.25, 0 0.10, or you can put it in as 50, 15, 25, and 10. Um, either way, it's going to give the same average. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to the stat um, screen, and then we're going to go to edit. We do a lot with stats in the lists. If you have information in here, you can clear it out by hitting the clear button. So I'm going to go ahead and clear this data, and then I'm going to put these values in. So I'm going to put in the 90, 82, 95, 87, and then I'm going to go to the next list. Sorry, I have to enter first. Um, go to the next list and put in the weights. Like I said, you can either put in 50 or 0.5. Um, you can either put in 15 or 0.15, just be consistent with how you do it. So if you put in 25 for the first one, you don't want to put 0.1 for 10%. Um, so I would put those in. After I've entered in all of my data and checked to make sure that everything matches up, I hit the stat button again, and I go over to calculate, stat, calculate, and I choose the option one var stats. On one var stats, and some of you may have older graphing calculators where this screen does not come up, I will show you the commands. You would go to the same thing, the stat calc, the one var stats. Um, some of you, it may go directly to your calculator screen and say one var stats. Um, your list is in L1. That's where we put our, for the list, we want it to be our averages um, for each category. Uh, so this would be L1 is where we put this. Our weight would be L2. This is going to be our frequency. So this would go in our frequency list. To do that, you just hit second and the number two, and then you go down to calculate and hit enter. The very top part right here, X bar, is your average weight. So X bar is our weighted average, so our weighted average would be 89.75, um, which in most cases would round up to an A, so even though we had two categories that were B, they did not count as much as the two that were A's. For those of you that have an older graphing calculator, let me just show you that when, um, sorry, I didn't wait long enough, so, um, if this came up, the one var stats, when you hit the stat calc and went over to one var stats, um, your command that you would put in is just one var stats, and then you would do L1 comma L2. Um, to do this, you would just do the one var stats, like I said, the stat, go over to the calculate option one, and then you would do second, the number one would give you L1. The comma button is right here above the seven. And then I would do second L2 and then just hit enter and you would get the same thing. So that is if you do not have that screen that comes up that prompts you to put in your lists. As always, thanks for watching.